All right, we are back on Most Buffalo and with a return of Mostly Interesting. Slowly we go. Yes, what a way to slowly regain a little bit of normalcy. Um, and Maria, we swear we didn't do this on purpose. <laughs> <laughs> According to Reuters, a company in Belgium wants you to send them your hair. Mm -hmm. The Hair Recycle Project turns your locks into matted squares that can absorb oil or be used as biocomposite bags. They say it's a better alternative to burning the hair in an incinerator. I'm not sure who's doing that and releasing toxic gases. To join the program, you do have to be a hairdresser, pay a yearly fee, and send them the hair. Hmm. So, Adrian and I talked about this at length today. Yes. Here's my question. Yes. What's not environmentally friendly if you just put it out there and let the birds make little nests out of it? That's exact. Adrian, isn't that exactly what I said? Did you say that? <laughs> did you? Did. Say I was like, yes. I was like, let the let the birds make nests. So I said to Kate. In case you missed it earlier, I accidentally picked up the wrong bottle and sprayed oil in my hair today, okay? Which is why it looks lovely like this, okay? So I'm reading the story and I'm like, it's gonna absorb oil. And I'm like, not my hair. <laughs> my hair is gonna put oil it's into like the atmosphere. I'm gonna need this to wear it like a hat. <laughs> oh. You know, and I told Kate, today, I just don't care. It Listen, is what it is. We are being grateful for where we're at. That's, what we got going on. That's right. And we're glad you're with us too uh, for, for all of it. Good and bad, indifferent, wild, insane, and hair bags. We'll see you later. We are what we are. <laughs> we'll be right back.